In the wake of former President Donald Trump's criminal probe, a new analysis is shedding light on the real issue surrounding his indictment. In a piece published by The Guardian, Democracy editor Kira Lerner noted, as prosecutors in the New York courtroom reiterated, the issue wasn't just that Trump directed these payments that put him at fault, but that the timing of them likely changed the course of his campaign and paved the way for Trump to interfere with election results for two cycles. She added, and the criminal charges were only part of the picture when it comes to Trump's election meddling and the threats he has posed to U.S. democracy. Lerner went on to cite remarks from election lawyer Norm Eisen who recently spoke out about the charges Trump is facing as he noted how serious the allegations are. These are very serious criminal allegations that matter to our democracy because of the effect that paying this hush money could have had suppressing a scandal, saving the Trump campaign, altering the outcome of the 2016 election, and setting up the election interference that we investigated in the first impeachment. Eisen said during a recent interview. He added, and that culminated in the attempted coup following the 2020 election and the violence of January 6. According to Lerner, this week's developments could lead to historical, groundbreaking changes. This week's indictment could be the first time that Trump, or any president in the country's history, is held accountable for a criminal act. But this may not be the only time Trump faces courtroom allegations this year, she wrote. Although many Republican leaders and lawmakers have pushed back with opposing views of the indictment handed down by Manhattan District Attorney Alvin Bragg's office, Lerner notes that Democracy 21's Fred Wertheimer stressed the importance of accountability, even where presidents are concerned. People have to be held accountable for their actions and when a former president of the United States has allegedly committed a criminal act and is found guilty, he has to be held accountable, said Wertheimer. He also noted, at the heart of our democracy is the fact that nobody is above the law. Everyone in our society has to comply with the rules. That's just the fundamental principle of the rule of law.